That's an interesting that you would say that, because a lot of people say I look like Dave Siddick from TV on the radio. Very interesting. What do I think of the Beastie Boys? Well, uh, I think they're a little too old to still be playing music. I mean, it works for the Rolling Stones because there's only one old guy running around on stage with a microphone, not three. When I see clips of the Beastie Boys performing live, it's like bingo night at the nursing home. <laughs> The last cool thing the Beastie Boys did was Sabotage, and that was like 14 years ago. I own Beastie Boys albums. I'm not gonna lie to you, when I was a kid, I listened to License to Ill a lot. And I still think Paul's Boutique is one of the most amazing hip-hop albums of all time. I didn't like it when it first came out, but uh, I warmed up to it. Yeah, the mix-up. Was that like a proper studio release? Because if it was, it's kind of a letdown. If I wanted to listen to instrumental music, I'd ride an elevator. Do you notice how they're all dressing up now, wearing like silk shirts and ties and hats? We were doing that nine years ago in Brooklyn at the start of the Electro Clash movement. Beastie Boys trendsetters? I don't think so. The Beastie Boys are in their 40s. They're all married. Two of them have kids. They all have gray hair. Even Miss Mass... Even Miss Master, even their DJ is getting old, and they still insist on people calling them by their nicknames, King Ed Rock, MCA, Mike D. It's like when I'm 40 years old, I can guarantee you people aren't going to be calling me by my nickname. They're going to be calling me by my real name, Todd Mokes. That's just the way I see it. I'd say every time I post a blog, I get like three or 400 responses, and uh, everyone seems to agree with what I have to say.